Hey everybody, I'm Courtney Rolston and welcome to Homemade with Coles. The recipe I'll be making today is a slow roasted lime and ginger pork shoulder. It's a meltingly tender roast, give it a little twist up with some aromatic Asian flavors. I've picked up my Fight m and branded piece of pork in at Coles. And this is a two and a half kilo piece of pork. So roughly around an hour for every kilo of pork. So this is gonna take about two and a half hours to cook. And I've got a roasting tray here that I'm gonna pop it into. I'm just gonna remove the netting because I think the honey and everything's gonna get stuck in this. So I'm taking that off. Okay, so for our lime and ginger marinade, I've got about a quarter of a cup of honey in my bowl here. And I'm gonna add into that some fresh ginger. So I'm just gonna use my little microplane. I've got a couple of cloves of garlic. And seeing as I've got the microplane out already, I'm just gonna grate the garlic in as well. You could just finely chop this if you liked. All right, that's our garlic grated. I'm now going in with two tablespoons of Worcestershire sauce. Adds a really nice background flavour. And I've also got two tablespoons of soy sauce. This is gonna add our beautiful seasoning, some saltiness to go with that sweet pork. We need some lime as well. It wouldn't be lime and ginger without some lime. So I'm just going to squeeze some lime cheeks in. Just gotta give this a mix to work that honey through everything. All right, that looks all nice and mixed through. All right, really simply, this is just going to get spooned over our pork shoulder. We're just gonna pop this in the oven and it's just gonna do its thing for a couple of hours. Make sure all the pork is covered in that lime and ginger marinade. All right, smelling good already. All right, all we need to do is cover it now. So I've got some baking paper and this is just gonna help to stop our foil from sticking. And we wanna seal this really well with some aluminium foil. Just make sure it's all nice and tight. You don't want any air getting in there. We wanna create a nice little oven for that pork to just kind of cook slowly away in. All right, super simple. My oven inside is set at 160 degrees. I'm gonna give this two and a half hours and then we're gonna have a little sneak peek and see how it's going. All right, let's have a little look at our pork. It's had two and a half hours in the oven and it is smelling so good in our house. Let's remove that. You can just test it there and I can see that's just gonna pull apart very easily. Look at that, really super tender. All right, I'm gonna pop this back into the oven for 30 minutes just to get a bit of color on the outside and just to reduce that liquor down slightly. And that gives us time to do our rice and our bok choy. All right, steamed rice to go with our beautiful pull apart pork. I've got one and a half cups of water on the boil in our little pot. And I'm going in with the cup of rice into the one and a half cups of boiling water. You just wanna bring this up to the boil and leave it uncovered until all the water has evaporated. Then I'm gonna pop the lid on and just let it steam for around 15 minutes. So let's switch the pans over. Have a little look, I'll just show you. Fluffy, beautiful rice that's just going to absolutely soak up all of that lime and ginger pork liquor. So we'll just set this aside with the lid on. All right, we need some greens to complete the picture. So I've got some beautiful fresh bok choy here. Slice these in half. And these will literally take seconds in a hot pan. A couple of drops of sesame oil. And these are literally going to go in around two minutes maximum. I'm just gonna put on a little dash of water to help steam them. While they're cooking, we can slice up our chili. I love a bit of fire, especially in Asian recipes. So I'm just going to sprinkle this over the top of our pork. All right, I've collected the pork from the oven. Look at that. It's got all that beautiful kind of char siu stickiness that you see in the Chinese barbecue shops. Absolutely beautiful. Give it a final glazing with our lime and ginger. Look at that, a little bit of crusty, burny brown bits on the outside, beautiful stringy, promise you meltingly tender pork and that is just meltingly tender. All right, at the risk of this whole entire pork piece falling apart, I'm going to transfer it onto our serving platter. It is so soft. There's a few bits there that we've pulled off already. Spoon some of that beautiful fluffy rice. All right, our gorgeous steamed bright green bok choy. Complete our pitcher. 
I absolutely love chili, so I'm going to scatter some of that over. And I'm just going to scatter some coriander over. Just absolute comfort food at its finest. Slow roasted lime and ginger pork shoulder with all of the trimmings.